Good morning everyone. Welcome back to Vlogmas day two slash three. I'm not really sure what day it is. I've kind of got confused because some people start Vlogmas like the day before December starts or some people start it on December 1st. Uh, but welcome back to the second vlog. So this is literally, well I just ended last night's vlog because I was so tired last night. Went straight to sleep. Me, Haz and Byron all slept in my bed and I have a double bed which is fine. Uh, it was just very cosy. Did you I didn't find it bad. I slept so well. Did well, you sleep? Comfiest see. thing ever. Yeah. I was in the middle again. I always sleep in the middle. I did sleep to be fair, I just woke up a couple of times. But we are now, well, I'm actually ready. We washed our hair this morning, had a shower, it's feeling really fresh. And today we're actually going Christmas shopping, which I'm really excited for because I'm gonna be honest, I haven't even thought about what I'm gonna get anyone for Christmas yet. I've been so like busy thinking about other things that I haven't even think, oh my God. I've done all my presents. I've literally got them all. She's giving everyone gifted stuff. I'm doing care packages of things that I've never opened that I don't need. I'm buying for my nan, my mum, Atticus. Atticus is obviously easy, but my mum and nan. Oh, I'm I also getting people actual presents. Yeah. That I've ordered them already. I want to get my... So what, what are you buying at Vista? Not sure. Basically, we're going she to Vista Village. Bag for herself, I think. <laughs> we're going to Vista Village and we're going to do some shopping. I think I'm going to buy my mum, but she's downstairs. Um... Probably get my nan something as well. We're just gonna go shopping basically. And Vista Village is so nice at Christmas. If you get the chance to go, please go. It's so Christmassy. We were meant to leave an hour ago, but you know, we were really tired and we've just had a really slow morning. And oh, also, I announced the podcast that we're doing in yesterday's vlog, but I didn't really talk about it properly. So some point today, I'll sit down and I'll properly talk about our podcast that we are releasing. Cause I feel like I didn't hype it up enough. Like yeah, we've like me. I, I literally yeah. like, we announced podcast. Oh wait, I've never even talked about that. Yeah, like we literally have a podcast. Like this is so exciting. Um, so I'll probably talk to you guys about that later. But I'm excited. We're gonna go to Bista now. It's about a 40 minute drive. So let's go. Hi, Look at these two in my bed. Hi, Daily Pops. Welcome back to the Chan. They kind of suit my bedroom. I know. Do you want to stay? Especially. Oh, don't turn me on. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Like, oh. Don't excite me. Who's excited to go to Vista? Me because I've never, never been. been. Yeah, oh actually, yeah, you've never been. Byron, this is our third time. And every time I come back with something I shouldn't, so. What did you come back with the first time? Oh, Blentiaga bag. And a Prada bag, and now. Alright, Flexer. How much have you got on your fingers again? 10k? <laughs> Nothing, I'm Mm. Listen to the podcast to find out that argument. Here is my OOTD. I've got jogging bottoms from Misguided, top from Pretty Little Thing, necklaces from yeah, LaRue so Jewelry. Is it? Yeah, there's like lots of black lines on it. Oh. <gasps> is there really? I've shut my pants in the case. Oh, you're kidding. Get some pants? Oh my god, okay, well, I'm about to change my coat then. I was going to say coach from Misguided, no, but I always need to. It, but there's just lots of like black, it looks like mascara. But, like, really? Thicker lines. Oh my god. <gasps> I'm changing coats. We have arrived at Bissa Village. The parking is ridiculous because we didn't realise, well, it's Cyber Monday basically, so everyone is kind of stacked at Bissa Village and we were gonna leave really early, but we were just too tired. So when we got here, we drove around the car park and there was loads of signs saying, oh, car park full, car park full, but you know when you just don't believe it? So I just drove around the car park anyway and it really was full. So we've <laughs> we parked in Tesco, just over there. And we've got three hours free parking, so. Here we go, we've come in at a completely different entrance to what I've actually come in before. Because obviously normally we park in Bista Village, so we come in right by where Gucci is, but this time we're going into the Ralph Lauren end. I'm so excited, I'm really excited to buy my mum's present. She has no idea what I'm getting at, and to be honest, neither do I, but I'm just excited to buy it. We are in Balenciaga, and I really like this jacket. Balenciaga. 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 Oh, Balenciaga, oh. <laughs> Sorry, I mispronounced it. Love this. Love that. Is that what you were going to buy last time? No, I just saw it the first time here. Byron showed me it, but I think it's really nice. I just wouldn't wear it enough. You just, it would be so cute. Just oversized. Yeah. With like some trainers. Oh, fun. I always say I'm going to come to Bista and not spend anything. And here I am walking out with three bags. But only one of them is mine. The rest of them I've actually bought for my mum. So I'm hoping that my mum doesn't watch this vlog. In fact, I'm going to make sure she doesn't watch this vlog. Because I've bought her the majority of her Christmas presents. I'm so excited for her to see them. Nice. Right, get to the petrol station now. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to ring my mum. Oh my god. I'm not going The tire has popped! I'm not going now. No, it hasn't popped. Babe, did you not feel that? Yeah, I don't think it's popped. Look at the man. Oh my god, it is entirely down. <laughs> it's not entirely accurate. There. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. Oh no. no, it's not. What? I'm what so that? confused. What is Someone that? help me, I don't know what to do. <laughs> 
like down, but I don't know what to do. No, but it, that felt like, you know, it literally felt like you were going over something. Did you not think? What if there's a kid on now? <laughs> Right, it feels like we're on a roller coaster. Oh, wait, I've got my seatbelt on. Wait, I'm stuck. Go on. Just pull it out. Yeah, you pull that all the way out and walk around with it. Come on, now. Oh. It's got whiplash. Right, so she said that I need to pull, unstick the screw this. Can you show me if I find it? Right, so it's unscrew it. She said, unscrew it, come on. See? What? The tie. What is it? It says 5 PSI. Is that it? It says it's five. meant to be 32. Oh, no, it says 6. It says 6. It says 6. Oh, my God, it's lifting up. <sighs> oh, now, now, put it back on. Now it's going up to 26. Now it says 8. Oh, it's going to pump it up. It's pumping up. <laughs> Leave it in. Is it lifting off the ground? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, no, it says 9. Oh, so it's, it's counting it up. Oh, yeah, this is fine. Imagine it's meant to be 32. Oh, my God, it's counting it up. It says 9 now. Oh, that's no, it says 13. You may as well check all your tires while you're here, you know? Yeah. Oh, now you've got a little air at. And people say YouTubers aren't talented. Here we are. Here I am. I was going to say changing a tire. I'm definitely not. <laughs> My tire. I'm not even kidding. We literally thought the tire would come off. It was what act full actual. No, like we actually thought the tire would come off. Like, I've never felt like that before. <laughs> Oh my god, and we're like over an hour from home as well, so I literally shat myself. Byron's checking the other one for me. What's that one? Maybe it's meant to be 26 PSI then. Oh no, because that's 29. Well, we don't need to anymore, Maybe not then. You would have seen in Vlogmas Day 1 that I was talking about. Oh, oh my god. I'm saying it's full is because of all the weight on that side of the car. We've got the case in here, and we've got all the bags on this side of the car. Oh my god, that was so scary. I was saying in Vlogmas Day 1 that I was like, oh my god, what like 24. I was saying in Vlogmas Day 1, oh my god, like I can't believe my tyres going to, I think it's going to go down, I need to get it changed. Then I went to drive out of McDonald's and it went, do, 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 yeah, that's fine. And it went, do, 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 yeah, do the other one. And I was like, oh my god, my tyres fell off. And we were looking around for like people's reactions to see and like, there was these two guys and I was like, okay, if they pull a face, then my tyres come off. But like, when I was just putting the air in, I could see, and it looks like the car's back to normal now. Oh no, it still looks down a bit. Oh, God's sake, man. So we are now back from Vista Village and Atticus is gonna open some of the presents that you guys got him from Winter in the City yesterday. So, okay. do you wanna open that one first? Yeah. Mum's opening hers as well, but she's ill, so she doesn't wanna be on camera. But she says thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Cause it's quite hard, I Atticus. I manage it. No, I need help. Oh my God. It's so sick, isn't it? <laughs> That's really cool, I got you that. It's really cool, isn't it? I just showed mum the onion. Oh, what's that? It's bacon. <gasps> Toy Story. Is it? And you've got your buzz pajamas on, yeah. Right, you hold the box and I'll rip it. Hold the box. Hold it tight. Oh. <gasps> what is it? Toy Story cupcake kit. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> I was gonna say you're welcome, but it's just trying to get you it. And then what else have you got in here? You got this one. Some bubble wrap. Some bubble wrap and what's inside the bubble wrap? Someone made you something. That's why I like, I really like that. Oh, oh Atticus. I actually really, I, I love it. Oh. Mum. Yeah? I, I'm going to hand that in my room. I absolutely love it. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Has that been your favourite? Yeah. Yeah. Thank oh. you. Oh, <laughs> thank you to whoever got him that. That's really cute. Is it soft? It is nice. <gasps> yeah. Where are you going to hang it? On your door? Yeah. You love it. Yeah, because my wreath... Your wreath keeps falling down, yeah. doesn't it? So yeah. I'm going to hang that on there. <laughs> it's really nice, actually, yeah. that is. Mum, if you have a look. Yeah. No, that is really nice. That's really nice. It looks like it's from that vintage shop in Olney. Yeah, I was thinking that. Um, chocolate. Yeah. And you got more chocolate there, but you've got the bottom bar. Oh my god, sorry, I shopped it. You've got the Smarties bar at the yeah. bottom, and then Mummy's got the dairy milk on top. And then, oh, guess what? What? <gasps> I saw this earlier, didn't I, Anna? You did. So, who's gonna help me with this? Open it in a minute. Shall I give you all the other presents, then you yeah, can open yeah. it? And then this one yeah. is very exciting. I saw this. And I got really excited. It's from the Disney store. You got a dinosaur. Oh, oh my god, I keep dropping it. Sorry, you got a dinosaur. 
Yeah. I think it's like a finger puppet dinosaur. You put your fingers in it. Not like a finger puppet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright then, that's good. We've got two Kinder Eggs. These are from all different people, by the way. And then someone made us these Christmas decorations, which I also put in here. We've got one each. And I can't remember who's who. You can hang them on your tree. Are they aquabees? Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. I might have the aquabees. I don't They're know. Aquabees or the other one. You know. Or the other ones. Hammer, I can't... Hammer beads. Hammer beads, that's it. Someone made you those. Okay. And then, are you ready to see this? Yeah. Atticus, this is so cool. I'm going to let you open it. Oh, how cute. You saw that, didn't <gasps> Did I you see it? I pointed that out to him. Did you see it in the Disney shop? Yeah. Isn't that lovely? At least I didn't pick it up. No, you or, didn't pick it up. Or did no. I have two? You would yeah. have had two, yeah. Oh, isn't that lovely? Yeah. Say thank you, Atticus. Thank you. Yeah, but you've also got some other cards, but they're in my other bag. But they're all the presents. So what do you say? You thank you. Things, you got some lovely things. How lovely is that? I'm finally home. I just went and dropped Byron off at the train station and now I am back. And honestly, I am knackered. I haven't been at my house properly like by myself for a week now because obviously I went from Benefit, then I went come back here to get my car, went straight to Winter in the City, come back here, stayed over last night, obviously at my house with Byron and Haz. And then we went to Bista Village today and now I'm just absolutely knackered. But this weekend, obviously Benefit was incredible. I spoke about that in my last vlog. But this weekend, was something else like i haven't done a meetup for a while i think the last one i did was february vidcon and that was with soph and roxy because because for some reason in summer i was actually in bali that's why i couldn't go i knew i was doing something i was in bali but i really wanted to go to the winter one because i used to go to summer in the city as like a kid before like i did youtube and i used to go to meet people i went in 2014 i went in 2015 so it was really important for me to like go and do the first winter one and i cannot even explain how incredible it was to meet all of you i had a meet up on the first day but we went out on the floor for literally like three hours beforehand and met as many of you as possible and that is one thing i always make sure i do when i go to events like this i don't understand why you go if you don't want to go and meet viewers there's no tea like no shade or whatever but like i just don't get going to an event like this if you're not going to go stand on the floor and meet people like there is literally no excuse like the staff are so so lovely the staff was so helpful they helped us get like a point they gave us security guards they set up a line and there was people that i didn't get to meet unfortunately because they did cut the line because it was so big like we, we genuinely didn't expect it at all but we met as many people as we could and and it was just incredible and i was not expecting it in the slightest so thank you so much and for everyone who was like say hi to your mum and Atticus and it just it hits different when people say it to you in real life like of course it means the world when people type it to me and i see it online but when someone's standing in front of you and saying it to your face it just hits different and it puts everything into perspective and it really does make me realize why i do what i do and being on stage at, like when we were doing our panels with two of my best friends like we've said for so long we've always wanted to do something together and now we've got this podcast and i i'm just so excited for it like it is everything i've wanted and more and it's going to be so amazing and being on stage and i used to have such terrible stage fright like if you'd said to me like five years ago go on stage in front of all those people and talk i would have been like absolutely not and then yesterday i just wondered on that stage like it was easy it was so strange like i'd never felt like that but i just felt so comfortable and i was on stage with byron for both of my panels and obviously has for the second one and i just can't even like i was so happy like i felt at home when i had the mic in my hand like it was weird like i loved it so that was my winter in the city experience thank you so much to all the staff and thank you so much to everyone for making it so so amazing we went out for like a celebratory dinner last night we went to tgi fridays it was like me byron has shannon kirsty joe jack sam i think i got everyone and we went and celebrated and it was so much fun then we had the drive home and obviously with my tire popping that was just traumatic i mean nothing touch wood apart from the fact my exhaust fell off a couple of weeks ago and obviously it's on fix i got it fixed the next day like it's fine now nothing has really happened to me bad with a car but i was terrified just because it's something so simple like blowing up a tire but it never happened to me before but mum said to me at least now you know how to do it if it happens again so everything happens for a reason at least i wasn't alone i was with byron 
Darren has when it happened. But yeah, like I said, went to Pizza Village today, got some cute bits, got my mum some really nice presents. I'm keeping my voice down because she's downstairs. But obviously I'm not gonna show you what I got her, uh, but I got her some things she's really gonna like, so I'm really excited to give her them. And now I'm just gonna tidy my room and I've got all of your letters to go through actually that you guys gave me. I started going through them the other night at like quarter to two we were up and somebody gave me onion somebody gave me corn on the cob like you guys are literally the best like it's crazy how much you listen i'm also really sorry i'm a day late on vlogmas because i was at winter in the city all day meeting you guys i didn't have chance to edit the video so tonight i finally got a chance to edit but i'm just like so happy and just so excited like these past couple of weeks i've been really stressed because i've had a lot of ads going out at once and it's really upset me like people probably think i don't care people are like oh she just does ads whatever but it has genuinely upset me and stressed me out how it's all fallen because it literally looks like i've just done ads for two weeks straight so i've been kind of stressed and i'm happy now it's all over and now i can just focus on doing my christmas content i'm so happy i'm filming such an exciting video tomorrow so yeah very excited i'm gonna stop rambling now and i'm gonna go through all of the stuff that you guys got me i've got my cup of tea and i've also got this candle here as well i thought this was discontinued from yankee candle absolutely not snowflake cookie they've brought it back i'm so happy I just wanted to do a quick haul of what I got from Bitter Village today. I got two things that I've wanted for a long, long time and they had them both on offer. So I'm really excited so I'm going to show you what I got. First of all, I got myself a laptop case. I've been to Vista four times now and every single time I see this laptop case and I've put myself off buying it but then I finally thought I travel so much that I'm going to need a really good laptop case. So I decided to just bite the bullet and just treat myself and I absolutely love it. I love the fact it doesn't want to focus though. This is very strange but I literally love it so much. It's black it's waterproof it's super super protective which is why i obviously wanted it then it's got the prada logo there and then just to match with that as well i actually got the black cosmetic makeup bag again i wanted the black one for so long me and byron have been to bista four times and every single time they never have the black one and as soon as we saw it we both grabbed it and was like oh my god we're gonna get it so this was actually marked down from oh they've put a sticker on it so i can't see how much it was meant to be oh no so it was it was meant to be 290 and i got it for 185 which I know it's ridiculous for a laptop case but I will literally use this for like years and years to come so I thought I'd better get like a good quality one and then I think this was £80 not down from like 200 or something like that it was a really good saving it was like 45% off the entire store so I thought I'd treat myself to some things that I wanted because every time I go into London I have my bag I have my makeup bag I need a laptop case and I've got everything that I will literally use forever so very very happy with my purchases and I'm really excited to show you guys what I got my mum as well obviously you're gonna have to wait till Christmas and this bag is like damaged because they're like paper bags so i'm obviously gonna wrap it up properly but treated my mum to something and i'm really really excited and then i've also got a couple of bits in here as well but that's what i got very happy with my purchases and byron also bought a couple of bits as well he got a jacket and he also bought like the bigger toiletry version of this hasn't get anything because she, what she wanted they didn't actually have so she's just gonna get it elsewhere but yeah really really good day shopping very successful <laughs>